Hello everyone and welcome back to Final Fantasy 4 where we just beat Cognizo. Palm and Porm turn themselves into stone and we're trying to get an airship. But meanwhile, something is happening. He defeated Cognizo. His power continues to grow. Sire, regarding the last crystal, I know the place remains a problem. Then how about we have Cecil get it for us? Hmm. I am certain he will comply. After all, we have Rosa. We can exchange her for the last crystal. A primitive idea, but it just might work. And I will destroy him at the time of exchange. I shall convey your terms to him. Kane! Rosa, you'll see soon enough that I'm superior to Cecil. As if. But there's nothing here. The best place to hide is often in plain sight. Did, just, did no one know this was here? This seems very elaborate to be something that could have been built in a short amount of time. You hit it down here. Amazing! Ain't she a beaut? Right, let's get the Enterprise online. Here we go. Finally, we have our own airship. Nothing could go wrong now. Oh. The battle stations have run time to unleash the power of the Enterprise. Wait. What is that? It looks like a white flag. Kane. Hmm. So you're still among the living. Kane, you little maggot. Is Rosa safe and well? If you want her back, bring me the Earth Crystal. What? You shameless dog! We'll speak again once you have the crystal in your possession. And if Rosa means anything to you, you'll get that crystal. Why you? Wake up, Kane. I have nothing else to say to you. Oh yeah? Well, you suck. That's what I have to say to you. Cecil. That dirty scumbag. Sid, set a course northwest. For Troya. Kinda overcoming grief, defeated Kignazo, the Lord of Water. Alright. Let's see. There's some stuff we can go buy. But unfortunately it won't be a huge help to us. Welcome to Treya, where trees, uh, the city where trees and water abound. So here's an interesting thing. You go into the weapon shop, right? What can I do for you? What? This is all garbage. And there's a reason for that. Alright. I'm actually gonna... Gonna buy all that stuff. Anything in here? Nope. Okay. Oh, I actually have... I have enough of those. And enough leather armor. I th okay. We're actually uh, almost as well equipped as we can be going in there. What's this house? I don't remember this house. Welcome, what can I do for you? Oh, a membership pass! Proof of membership at the King's Pub. I'd be stupid not to do this. Hold on, we'll get- we'll- we'll see what our membership gets us. Hold on. Live a long life, I say. I'll take this place over heaven any day. Yes, I finally got a good seat at the counter. The ladies here always put a smile on my face. Stella, you're so beautiful. What? You're a man. Hey there, cutie. Want to chat with me for a while? I'll take good care of you. What's with that look? You've got a problem with me. Give me a holler if you want something. I'll, I'll take a double. It's a 
up here. I hope you carry a fat wallet, mister. It's all high rollers from here on, if you know what I mean. Shoot, you don't belong here. Bring me a fur coat next time, okay, sweetie? Wow. I'll buy you anything you want. Oh. I have to make sure everyone gets what they ordered. And then I thrust the blade into that goblin and off to him once and for all. Wait, how do I... That geezer keeps babbling about all his stupid adventures. If I have to hear one more story. Wait, I want to go talk to that woman in the back there. What, what is your deal? That old geezer better not mess with my Jenny. This place is weird. I'd like to leave now. Wait, did I talk to you? I thought you were a dancer. The air here is fresh. The food tastes great. I love this place. May I see your membership pass, please? Why, yes, you can. Thank you. Please enjoy the show. This seems elaborate. I don't think I've done this in a long time. Would you like to watch? Yes. Why are we just standing at the front of the stage? Wait, nope, now we're moving up. What are we doing? What have I done? We got Chocobo theme. If I had been naming the, these episodes, this one would be called What Have I Done? Because this is wasting a lot of time for no reason. Uh oh. Oh no. Mistakes were made. Uh. You know, I should probably get. I have a world to save. So. I should probably get to that. Oh, I also, I also have a girlfriend. Right, 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 right. Of course. I remember, I remember that first. Uh, is he, oh my god, he is like literally staring at his shoes. Yep. So that's a thing in this game. Eek! Get out of here, you pervert! This is the dressing room! Oh, oops, oops! My mistake, I saw treasure! I, w I wanted the treasure. Promise I'm not a pervert, I'm just a thief. Haven't you got better things to do than hang out here? Yes! I have so many things to do. For some reason, I thought shops were involved. That may not have been worth my $10,000. Oh, we gotta, we gotta change this. Uh-huh. There we go. Oh wait, nope, can't do that. Ruby, feather, leather, ruby, I think the wizard one is fine. I think guy gear is fine. Great bow, and what is my best arrows? Oh! Poison arrows? That's even better, actually. I think we'll go wizard hat. Gaia gear and ruby gloves. So what ends up happening here is the next dungeon. Oh, okay. Anyone wearing metal? Oh, here it is. I took a silver strong box to the northeast cavern, but it got stuck to the ground and I had to leave it behind. Yeah. Anyone wearing a, a metal item will be unable to act in battle in this next dungeon. And if all of your party members are unable to act, it's just game over. Go away. Can't you see I'm sunbathing? Oh, uh, sorry. Have you seen my husband? Where is that wrinkly old codger? Would you like to join us for a swim? Oh, for Pete's sake, why are you swimming in armor? It'll rust. Well, uh, yeah. Shoot! Go find your own place. Uh... Oh, 
I found naming way. What's here? Black chocobo farm? Thanks to the ample water supply here, we can grow fresh vegetables and even raise chocobos. Man, I... <sighs> Senzu and the art of raising chocobos. There's so many areas that I just never... Looked at in this game. New breed of chocobo discovered. Amazing black chocobo set to revolutionize transportation. Chocobos are real cute. I want to fly in a black chocobo, but I don't think they like me. They freak out when I try to get close. These black chocobos can't fly for some reason. The ones living in the chocobo village to the north can, but only at low altitudes. Though here, those chocobos can only land in forests. Convenient. Right, I think there's still some secrets we can get around here. So yeah, I do kind of want to spend some time looking around. Just because I don't. Usually when I play this game. This is kind of like opportunity for me to see some things that I don't normally see as well. Like the last time I played through this was like... 2018, which I guess isn't like that long ago. But there was treasure in here. Oh, there it is. Nope. Oh, okay, that's just not a... Gotcha. Uh, I have been trying to play through the 3D remake, and I just haven't gotten to the end. Have you heard of the Twin Harp? I heard you can transmit your voice really far with it. Wow, that sounds important. Aw, oh, Dry ether. That was worth it. Ether Decoy? I don't remember what a decoy does. Cool. All right. We got some good treasure. Should probably talk to the people in the castle about their crystal that we kind of need to I need to borrow. So there is other armor and weapons I could go get that are made of silver, but they would be completely worthless for what we're about to do. Welcome to Troya Castle. Please make yourselves at home. You should know about the crystal. Speak to the clerics inside the castle. The clerics are solemn servants of the gods. Honor them and conduct yourselves properly. Understood? A Damsian man recently drifted into Troya. He claims he's a prince. Troya's never been at war. I don't know how well we could defend our kingdom if fighting did break out. It's kind of a problem. Unlike most kingdoms, Troya is governed by women and all our soldiers are female. I hear Baron is becoming more and more aggressive. I hope they don't attack us. The clerics are convening in the chamber over there. You want me to dance for you? As if I'm a guard, not a dancer. This armor lacks strength, but affords excellent mobility. It's also very fashionable. Oh, okay. I'm starting to see why uh, you're feeling unprepared. The eight clerics are sisters. We make far more civilized rulers than men. Oh, it's like the, uh... Did I ever put that together? It's like the eight sages. No, it's twelve sages in Final Fantasy 1. Never mind. We don't know what to do. The Dark Elf stole our Earth Crystal. Equipping anything metallic inside the Northeast Cavern will hamper your movement. By that, I mean stop it dead in its tracks. If you're looking for the Dark Elf, try the cavern on the island to the Northeast. Without the Crystal, Troya might become a wasteland once more. The Dark Elf is weak against metallic weapons. He has set up a magnetic field around his lair for protection. If you can recover the crystal, we will allow you to borrow it. Please speak to us once you obtain it. We will consider lending you the Earth Crystal if you can reclaim it. You have governed over Troya for years with the blessing of the Earth Crystal, but now... Oh, that's right. It might be worth it to go get that silver stuff. Please give your voice down. There's a sick man resting in here. Edward! Cecil, you are, you're alive. I'm so relieved. I wish to join you again. In that condition, you'd only be a burden. Tell I can't begin to ask you for your forgiveness. Anna died because of me. I can never atone for that. Edward, your health should be your greatest concern now. You must try and rest. Young, so you survived. And Rydia... I see. This is terrible news. I always seem to find myself elsewhere when others are in need. Hey, I heard you took my good care of Cecil and Rosa. I appreciate it. Why don't you join us on the Enterprise? Together we'll rise above anything. You must be Sid, the airship engineer. Wait, does this mean we have an airship? Oh, but Cecil, why is Rosa not with you? 
Gomez holds her captive, but he proposed a trade. He will release Rosa in return for Troya's crystal. But the crystal lies in the hands of the Dark Elf. The Dark Elf. Cecil, you must take this. What is it? This is the only way I can be of any help right now. Receive the twin heart. Please, save Rosa. It's Edward's heart. He requires much rest. He is quite frail and his recovery will not be a quick one. We are attending to the prince around here. Me, I'm the nurse. She's the doctor. Is there anything else around here that I can get that's useful? I don't believe so. I mean, it'd be silly not to look, right? I hate to miss out on, like, a really good bow or something. Oh, wait, wait, wait. This is once a dungeon, but now houses, hosts, houses Troya's treasures. No, I admire on it. Yeah. Even if you lie, it doesn't help you. That's right. So we need to come back later. Because this, I believe, is all worthless. Oh, that grants haste. All right. That's less worse, worthless than I thought. Uh-huh. Tent, a tent. I screwed something up. Ether? Maybe not. Ruby ring, which I... Ah, uh, I just bought those! Uh, I guess we'll make do with what we have. Or at least try to. This next fight is super difficult. Really wouldn't mind the silver stuff, but I don't think we're anywhere close to having enough money. Ah, Palm and Porm. You'll be remembered fondly. This is another place where I would grind a ton. This probably is where most of my grinding comes in. Just because the next fight, like, in my head, I probably made it a lot more difficult than it needed to be. Well, that is worthless. How much experience Tella needs to level up? So much. So, little Chocobo Forest here. There's the black Chocobo. There's the white Chocobo. Which restores your MP. So that's the other thing that makes this like a good grind point, is that you can come up here. Level up, come in, heal up, restore your MP, and then go do it some more. Black Chocobo, giddy up! So the problem is, I couldn't take my airship, because there's only forest to land on here. I don't think we'll be able to get this cave done in this episode. This might not even be a good idea, but we will we will try. I want to actually kind of want to see if this setup even works. That magnetic field is powerful. Equipping anything metallic will slow us down. My claws appear unaffected. Fear not, we're, we stand invincible with my magic. So, I do, I do appreciate that they tell you like what works and what doesn't. Uh, let's try fire. So we can probably just, like, Osmos our MP back. Oh, that's very little damage. So yeah, Tella never gets any more MP. So that's kind of a problem. He's, he is useless in his current state. Got a high potion. Oh my god, same fight. I think... I think I'm just gonna have him attack, honestly. <laughs> like, why not? Having him do anything else isn't really worth it. Oh, 
Oh my god, I love having this map, by the way. I think the Kate Siths are kind of a pain. Ooh, those are worse. Oh my god, that's the worst counter. Uh, we will be stabbing you in the face. Getting needled. Uh, we'll use Kuraga. Oh, I'm so glad. That's so fast. <laughs> I'm so glad that it's not that bad. Dung leveled up. Okay. Alright, so that fight sucks. Oh boy. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. I'm gonna have him try to osmos his MP back. Unicorn horn? Alright. Where's my map? Yep. Okay, so where do I want to go? Alright, this fight seems better. Much more doable than the last one. Uh oh. As we fail to take out that ogre in a timely manner. Ah! Sid level up. Whoops. I went I went right right past that. Problem is. Cecil is so dependent on how many times he hits. Alright, this is workable. Ooh. Just have Tala keep using Osmos. Received an ether. Good, 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 good. Oh, which way do we go? I think this way's treasure. Which is what we want. This is another area I would literally run from every single fight in here. This is probably my first time ever fighting these monsters. Because I didn't want to deal with the mechanic because it was annoying. So I would just level up outside, come in here, and then run from everything. Man, even Cecil has more MP. Ether, nice. 2,000 gil, also nice. Nothing else, we should have enough uh, money by the end of this to get some of those mithril items. I keep calling them silver, but it's, it's mithril. Ow. <laughs> These things hit so hard, and our armor is so bad. Finish him off. I do have to say, I feel... No! I just wanted to heal. Okay, that's okay. That's okay. That's 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 fine. It's fine. I don't want to deal with their counters. This I will run from. That sucked. Ah, oh, that's so unfortunate. Alright. It's it's not too bad. We weren't too far in, and, and we had to go do some backtracking anyway. Right. Ow. Good hit? Yeah, ah. Oh, thought that was gonna be it. Alright, heal up. I 
feel like that's probably like most economical. Oof. Wait, can the what can these guys do? That. Yeah, that's not good. That's not what you want to see at all. I should probably be using potions, huh? Alright. I think we'll call it here at the save point. I might level up a little bit between episodes because this the, the boss fight in here it can get rough. But uh we'll see. I hope you guys are still enjoying Final Fantasy IV. I'm actually pleasantly surprised. I have I have some nitpicks that we've that we've talked about, but overall I've been very happy with the pacing. At least I, I don't feel like I've needed to grind and I feel like they do like there's enough random battles that I feel like it keeps you pretty caught up so that's good anyway that's gonna do it for me as always thank you all so much for watching and I'll see you next time <laughs>